More than 16 billion passwords exposed to the bad guys to use at their discretion. And the next time a data breach happens, it likely expose your information. I'm Christelle Bell. I'll tell you what you need to know to better protect your login credentials. Breach. They've just added to it now. It's 16 billion. After breach. Your password will be stolen. There's just no way around it. Every month, hundreds of companies are added to a massive list of data breaches, exposing the sensitive information of millions of customers. So that just tells you how much information is being hacked and breached all over the place on a constant basis. Last month, the headlines made waves as researchers announced a record-breaking breach exposing 16 billion passwords. Login credentials were exposed, potentially putting users of some online services like Apple, Facebook, Google, and Telegram at risk. Ken Colburn with Data Doctor says cyber criminals are attempting to put all the stolen information into one place, giving the bad guys an easy way to find victims. If the person you're doing business with online gets breached, that password is no longer usable. When a company you do business with has been breached, you should receive some type of alert, but don't wait to take action because the key is finding out if they got your information. And if so, change your password immediately. If you're using good, strong passwords and you use a unique password for each account, then you don't need to change them until you have a reason to change them. And use sophisticated passwords. Shoot for 16 characters. Lastly, use a different password for every single online account. Hey, you don't have to tell me. I know it's a pain in the backside. But hey, it's a lot safer than using the same password on all your accounts. If you use the same uh, password on multiple accounts, the bad guys have what's called credential stuffing bots. They have these automated systems that when a email address and a password have been discovered, they automatically try it on 10,000 websites to see if you're using the same password. Keep a secure list of your passwords, either digital or paper, to make sure you're using a different password for each account. There's also a website that you can use that can help you figure out if your email address is part of a breach, and we're sharing that with you. Just look for this story on our website at abc15.com consumer. I'm Christelle Bell. Got a consumer problem? Let ABC 15 know.